Firehawk. What is up, guys? Uh, Kings here, and welcome back to Borderlands 3. Today, we're going to talk about the Hellwalker shotgun. That is a reference to the Doom games and I'm uh, recording this video right now because I just found it in the wild and there's no specific location on where to find I'm using it right now I'm gonna pick it up soon and we're gonna listen to a really really cool sound when you can actually obtain it and pick it up so uh, I'm just gonna kill these enemies here which is I'm using the Hellwalker right now and it seems like all of the Hellwalkers are the same in the game there's no like specific uh details uh, not any like fire rates are any different like the damage aren't any different in my game mode at least so uh looks like it's anointed every time i find it and uh, we're gonna take a look at it i it dropped for me oh this guy's a bit annoying badass war dog uh i'm gonna see where it's at it's right there i'm just gonna use my skill here a few other enemies to take care of there we go i think everyone is dead there we go and it dropped over here for me so the drop rate for this thing is quite uh, easy uh, well if i can say so myself uh okay we get an one more enemy here i guess uh, i'm just gonna take care of this as you can see my shotgun is doing a lot of damage and so i'm playing on uh, le uh mayhem mode level three uh, this is legit, this is not offline, as you can see, this is online with the all the patches, uh, pistol, SMGs and shotgun damage is plus 50%, that's why I'm using, doing so much damage. Just drop for me right here, I just killed a badass enemy, and I have been grinding this game for a really long time, I found this gun from a, uh, from a boss, from, from world bosses. From normal bosses like the vault bosses and from normal enemies and from badasses so it seems like this is a it is a, a, a normal world drop as you can see here uh, damage is hopefully the oh, of course the animal is in the way the damage is 533 times 10 uh, on level 50 it has 50 4% accuracy, he has 51% handling, 1.0 seconds reload time, 4.20 seconds fire rate, magazine size is 2, and it says, so my demons, your time has come. I'm just going for my animal to pass here, it's always in the way, it's quite annoying actually. Okay, uh, over to the next one. Plus 57% weapon damage, plus 10% critical hit damage, plus 35% reload uh, speed. Consumes 2 ammo per shot, highly effective versus flesh, and it's anointed every time I find it. It seems like this gun is the same every single time. On action, skill, and weapon stages, effect damage and chance are increased by 75% 75, 75 for a short time. Uh, I'm going to take a look at the one I am holding at this point. It is the exact same. So it seems like the speed loading Hellwalker is the same for everyone, at least in uh, in Mayhem 3. So I'm going to pick it up here and we're going to listen to a really cool sound. I'm going to replace it with my, I guess, my sniper here. Listen to this. So it's a reference to the Doom games. Uh, so I have two of it right now. I'm just gonna replace it back with my sniper rifle. I'm gonna just find it here. It's right there. The Lyuda. Uh, I don't know how to pronounce that, but we're gonna talk about the Hellwalker this time. So it seems like the Hellwalker is uh, well. It's it's one of my guns to go to. Like I can show you guys here. I'm playing on Mayhem 3 on true Vault Hunter mode and I'm using my action skill on uh, my my flak as you can see I'm doing pretty high damage and uh, my setup is quite decent I'm just gonna go into my skill 3 here and just show oh, no not skill 3 I'm gonna go into my settings here and look at my my, my things here I have plus 70 17 percent shotgun damage uh, I have Jacob's weapon critical uh, damage plus 45 percent and this is a Jacobs manufacture uh, shotgun so this is a really good weapon to go to when you're using flak uh, with the skills because I'm, I'm I'm not doing a pure crit build here 
And I'm also doing... Uh, okay, this Vault Hunter is, is talking over me. I'm sorry about that. I'm still doing the story here. Um, so the uh, the Hellwalker is my go-to weapon, to be honest. And uh, it's a pretty good pretty good uh, weapon to choose when you're going for this build. Uh, is there a side mission here? Just, uh, you know what? I'm just going to pick this up. Like, I'm not quite done with the... Uh, with the uh, true Vault Hunter mode yet, but I'm still using this weapon as my choice because it's wrecking every single thing. We're gonna find an enemy here and we're gonna yes. see how much damage it does. And uh, like I said, the drop rate is quite normal for this thing. I've seen a lot of it. I've seen a lot of it so far in this game. And like I said, I've seen it drop from normal enemies, badass enemies, I've seen it from uh, world bosses. I've seen it from uh, vault bosses as well, so uh, it's a pretty good easy find, but it's my go-to weapon when it comes to come to flag. As you can see here, 21k. Uh, we're gonna test out the damage on this thing here. Uh, how much? 98k. What was that? Was that actually 98k? It's a lot of damage. A lot of damage for my build because I'm going with the. Uh, Okay, I just hit it on. <laughs> I was way too, I was way too close right there. You can see a lot of damage from this weapon when you're going for Flak and the Jacobs build, like with, with the pure crit. So I'm, I'm just killing everything up, and this is, like I said, mayhem mode level three on true Vault Hunter mode. I know there's not not any different between normal mode and 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 true Vault Hunter mode, but this is mayhem mode level three. But it gives me 50% more shock and damage, but it's still it does tons and tons of damage so this weapon is just it's just pure fun and it makes this really cool sound when you shoot just listen to this All of you are weak. makes this guitar sound and it's absolutely amazing uh, so this is my favorite weapon so far in this game and like I said it drops from badasses normal enemies um, world bosses and of course vault uh, monsters or bosses in general so if you want to find this weapon it's pretty easy to find and it's perfect for the build of flak because I'm going with the Jacobs build here uh, with the crit so uh, anyway hopefully this video was helpful for you guys uh, we're just gonna take a look at the skins for it if you want to see that I'm just gonna go into my my uh, my thing here and I'm gonna press F because I'm playing on PC and we're gonna go into uh, the skill here which is X we're gonna take a look at all the skins for it so this is the normal skin right here uh, it's quite nice it's like wooden wooden and, and steel we have like this retro blaster we have like the golden skin and we have the gearbox prime which is a really nice skill uh, I mean skin for this thing we have the butt dazzle which is the pre-order I think the butt stallion skin here we have the fire and ash we have the mala wannabe and we have the dead set which is a quite nice skin for it as well we have the it's poop i love this skin i don't know why but it, it looks just it's different from all the other skins and we have like ink and kill which is a pretty nice skin we have red sands we have the leather and reg uh, regrets. We have the deep Nebula, which the one I'm using right now, which was my favorite skin so far in this game. It looks so nice. And we have the uh, psychedelic. Uh, we have the hot blooded, which is the uh, which is the Moxie skin. We have the uh, Burrage steel, uh, the Thunderhead, which is a quite nice skin as well. We have the Gunfetti, uh, a Pain Bow, Creep Skull, which. I think I pronounced it right. We have the Skell Bones, which is the last. Uh, no, no, the last. We have actually have a roll. Uh, we have the Black Dragon. We have the Extra Spectral, and we have the Blueberry Limonade. So, a lot of nice skins here. So this is how the uh, how how the weapon looks like. It's quite nice. Uh, it's the Doom reference, of course. So my demons, your time has come. And the guitar sound, it, it, it sounds, when you pick it up, it's quite nice. Uh, so this is how we get the weapon, just farm normal enemies, farm badasses, farm world bosses, and farm the vault 
uh, the, uh, the vault uh, monsters as well, the, uh, the vault bosses, and you will eventually get it. And it's perfect build for Flak because it's a Jacobs, uh, Jacobs uh, manufacturer. And if you go with the right skills and the right uh, perks here, like the right uh, class mod and the right artifact, you will get a really nice build with this gun. So anyway, guys, if you enjoyed this video. Please like on this and uh, subscribe for more Borderlands 2 tips and tricks and gameplay and videos. So hopefully I will see you guys in the next video. So take care now and... Uh